Now, ladies and gentlemen, the next contest it is set for one fall with a 10-minute time limit. But first, I want to introduce the manager, and uh, here he is, Captain Lou Albano. And in the corner to my right, from Elk River, Minnesota, weighing 237 pounds, here is Kurt Hennig. And in the corner to my left, from Osaka, Japan, weighing in at 270 pounds, here is Mr. Fuji. Mr. Fuji, former two-time co-holder of the Tag Team Championship of the World Wrestling Federation, now pursuing individual efforts, and thus far doing very well for himself. We'll find out just how well he will do against young Kurt Hennig. Looking pretty good. Fuji up in the air again and down. Drop kick by Hennig. Uh-oh. Missing with that one. Very nice maneuver. I thought Kurt Hennig. I am so impressed with him, but now he's in the ring with Mr. Fuji. Vicious wrestler, well experienced, and as you mentioned earlier, Two or three times, one half of the world stag team champion. And, uh, you know, if you make Mr. Fuji look bad, and if he gets advantage of you, he'll make you pay. He'll make you pay for it. Fuji delivering. Kurt Hennig to Louis Albano thus far. I would kind of hate to see a young man like Kurt Hennig being uh, injured permanently. He has such a great future in wrestling. And the man that could really hurt him permanently could be Fuji. And Kurt Hennig knows that. Hennig a real fighter. As was his dad in his professional wrestling days. Larry Hennig. Fuji digging into the trapezius area. Chopped to the back of the neck. And Fuji! That could be it! Yes. That could be it! He can get around on him. Hook a leg. Hennig finally up. Oh! oh. Just waited just a I don't think Kurt should have hit the rope, but he wanted to give that, rec that extra punishment there to be able to. Uh -oh. Uh oh, Fuji, down oh. into Hennig. Referee over, and a count of three. Too bad. Fuji is going to hurt someone really bad with that maneuver one of these days. Fuji defeating Kurt Hennig who, as we said before, is a real fighter. He is some competitor, and he does have a bright future. Mr. Hennig does. Here is the time. Three minutes and ten seconds on the winner, Mr. Fuji. The Fuji victorious as we take another look at him now. Fuji setting up Kurt Hennig. Setting him up with that slam, he has really dished out an awful lot of punishment at this point in time. From there, Fuji hitting the ropes, coming over, and putting a devastating leap, crushing right into Kurt Hennig. 